Today's podcast is brought to you by Audible. Get a free audiobook download and 30-day free trial at www.audibletrial.com slash agentacademy. Over 180,000 titles to choose from for your iPhone, Android, Kindle or MP3 player. And now, welcome to the Agent Academy. Downloading latest intel package. Welcome back. I was getting worried about you. Arg, matey. You be listening to... (laughs) Agent R Academy, episode 35, recorded on September 19th, 2018, which is Talk Like a Pirate Day. I be Captain Zelly Belly, and on the show today we have... Other... Captain. Oh, I, I I'm a <laughs> swashbuckler Soho. <laughs> All right, and I be Captain Goonie Guy, and you're gonna have to jump the plank. <laughs> <laughs> I got me this pause. I'm like, what's happening Walk exactly? <laughs> <laughs> I'm uh, sorry, swashbuckler Soho. Um, what have you been doing <laughs> on the high seas this week? <laughs> oh man, I've been plundering. <laughs> Uh, just lots of plundering. <laughs> lots of <laughs> shivering, too. Lots of shivering my timbers. <laughs> I don't really know what that means. <laughs> um, my timbers really got a good shivering. Uh, so, uh, anyway, uh, I was on Reddit the other day. <laughs> and What's this Reddit thing you be talking about? I was about? down below in the, on the, uh, I was swabbing the deck and I had my, my Reddit open on my device. Whoa, and, uh, whoa, is this whoa. Captain Redbeard? <laughs> <laughs> um, Family show. <laughs> and I noticed that um so about ninety five percent of Ingress the Ingress subreddit these days is just about OPR. Like That's right. it's always just people complaining or asking questions or something like that. And it's just it's overrun Reddit and it's hard to find anything interesting anymore. Like I, obviously, like everybody can go to uh, Google Plus, right? I mean, they have a separate section for OPR stuff there, so nobody ever spills over to the comms or to the any of the other type of. I don't even know what they're called there. I, I'll just call them sub G pluses. I don't know, uh, or groups or whatever. But on, uh, but at Reddit, like I don't know what they should do. Like, I mean, this is only going to get. This is only going to continue. I don't think I don't see this dying down anytime soon. Obviously, like Prime will come out and it might even magnify, and it'll just go all to hell. So, how about an ingress? I don't know underscore OPR or something. I don't know, uh, but that's my suggestion. Is just to like get all the OPR talk out of the subreddit. Well, there is an um, OPR yeah, there subreddit. Is, there, yeah, there is a specific one for that. So that would be up to the. The Reddit, the subreddit managers. I don't know oh, what they're okay. called. Um, it, the uh, operators to, or whatever. Yeah, well, yeah. They, they should. They should totally just to direct that flow. Do, yeah. do you know who actually runs the uh, OPR subreddit? No, is it you? That's, that's me. <laughs> <laughs> what? No one's in it except for me. Is it you? Oh, the year is the OPR. That's what one. I thought. Okay. I thought the same thing that you're saying, like uh, probably really? a year ago. And I was just like, really? man, it's just OPR stuff. And like, I'm just sick of like seeing, why is this a one star? You know, it just over and over again. It's just like, there should be a place where people can post their questions all about that. They can review all the stuff. And I made it and then got into that kerfluffle. Is that a pirate word? Probably not. Yes, I think you have to walk the plane. Absolutely. Use yes. kerfluffle. <laughs> but uh, Got into, you know, they, they don't like me over there, apparently, and um, I almost got banned, I think, last week when I... Oh, I, I remember that. Yeah. And oh, so I didn't want to be like, hey, you everybody come right here to the OPR yeah. rating. <laughs> <laughs> like, perfect timing, right? <laughs> so yeah. I didn't. So it's just sitting there. If anybody wants it, I'll, I'll relinquish it, because I would rather get used than, you know, just... Sit no one's using it, though? It seems like it would be super useful for sharing advice and files and like tips and things like that I mean, because people just yeah. didn't know about it right i mean now they know yeah about it. Wow, yeah i don't know spread the word everyone because we'll um, moderators because I, I don't I have would time say to do my that. <laughs> my opr submissions got way better once i hit 12 and realized what the criteria was yeah like i mean you kind of know what it is a 10 
you're kind of there, but also too, you're playing in a world where things are portals that shouldn't be portals. And right. so you, you kind of think like, well, that is, so why can't this be? And then when, once you get into OPR and you realize all the criteria that people are working on um, and evaluating against, that's when you really, actually it opened up the world to like quite a few submissions I hadn't considered before. So um, I got quite a few more portals approved because I didn't realize they were portable. Is that a word? Yeah, yeah, it, it is now. Portable. It's a part. Yeah. Word. So. Portable. I think it's a great subreddit, and I think it it totally merits its own conversation. So mm -hmm. I say you should keep it, and we just maybe need to focus on it a little. I, oh, if man. I post stupid, like, self promotional things on your subreddit, will you ban me? No. It's, it's, <laughs> it's pirate. It's the wild seas out there. You can post Woo! anything. International waters, people. <laughs> <laughs> Sweet. But, you know, speaking of, of like the OPR, they had a, you know, the update we talked about last week with uh, Pokemon Go getting to s be able to submit portals if they're level 40 or whatever in Brazil and like Portugal or somewhere. Anyway, they had a nice guide on like what sh sh makes a quality portal. Like it was better than mm -hmm. what I think we see before you get into OPR. So mm. I, I uh, think people who get level 10 should go read that and get an idea of what portals are acceptable. And mm -hmm. it, it seemed like it followed all the guidelines. It didn't have like, you know, this is a place where you, you play Pokemon, uh, you know, on a Switch. So make sure it's a portal or something. You know, it didn't have something like, weird in there. Yeah. That I saw. Like it's, someone who submits every Walmart that they go to or something. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, Oops. but I saw a picture. I think Arctic Rebel showed me a picture of uh, one from OPR that was a Walmart, and he was like, it's not just Soho. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? That's I wonder funny. if, like, you mentioning that encouraged some Walmart posts. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe Walmart. They might. Everybody, does Maybe. anybody play Ingress? Start <laughs> submitting portals. <laughs> I don't know. It's Next we'll see Kmart Blue Lights. Yeah. <laughs> Blue Lights. Every Walmart special, right? That's just like, tink, ho hos, a dollar off. <laughs> Maybe not. Ho hos. Okay. So hos, ho hos. So, so anything yeah. else this week? Uh, no, just a rant. Just a a, a nice juicy rant. Looking forward to it. next month, though. Next month is going to be uh, anime anime time. That, that and was we still have rant. To, we still have to plan out our little uh, our some sort of stream or something where we all sit around, we all sync up our Netflixes and watch. So I'm in that. Yeah. yeah. You down? I think it would be yeah. awesome. I still want to do like a, an ingress Halloween thing, like where we just do like the green room, like we wear all green and it's just like green candy <laughs> and the walls are green and, and all the Halloween lights and things are just <laughs> green. Like almost like, um, uh, like Willy Wonka, Charlie Factory. Like if you think about like when they go in the room and it's just like all the one color like that. Just like everything. It's like, how did all this get to be that color? I like that. <laughs> Weird science where he goes in the kitchen and everything's blue. Why? Yeah, maybe that's what I'm blue. thinking of. Well, uh, yeah. well no, I think it's I think it's just a similar concept, but maybe if people aren't chocolate factory savvy, they might get the weird science reference. <laughs> and right. smoking that weird stuff from the seventies. <laughs> That green stuff. Like They're green. still both pretty old references, though. So. <laughs> if they watched Hair, the musical, you know what I mean? <laughs> little Aquarius and... Hey, um, all you fans of Hee Haw, you remember. <laughs> 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 oh, my uh, God. Oh, wow. Anyway. So, so uh, we've also been plundering the seven seas. I, I've been mm. plundering no seas or shivering no timbers. Oh. Good for you. That, uh, But I did submit a mission. I don't know why I'm talking like this non-pirate weird voice. That, like uh, on a land. <laughs> <every laughs> Your like, anti-pirate accent is so weird. <laughs> Arr, matey. How's it going? And you, your shivery uh, timbers, oh, matey. Mark. Are you a landlubber? That's weird. Kind that sir. Is, that is kind of what I think a landlubber would sound like. <laughs> but anyway, <laughs> uh, did a uh, submitted a mission in a dead zone. So like 
Uh, mm. You just cannot get signal down there. So now the fun will be trying to complete the mission. That's evil. You're an evil man. Well, we'll <laughs> see. Real. I'm going to try to get it. I'm going to try to. He's trying to be evil. <laughs> I like evil. It. No, I like it. It's my pirate but... this week. I just yeah, stole some men. software. Dead men tell no tales. Well, yeah. I'm, uh, well, I'm going to be dead. That's not nice. <laughs> I mean, aren't we all? Eventually. Eventually. Yeah. <laughs> it just took a dark turn. Oh, <laughs> the dark okay, is so. creeping towards you. <laughs> <laughs> so, and it's sports ball season. And, it is. Uh, I don't yep. really watch much sports ball except for I grew up uh, just ingrained in Alabama around here with my family what? and parents. I've and, never heard of this. And uh, uh, so anyway, I, I pretty much listen to the game every uh, weekend that it's on because the rest of my family could care less and doesn't want anything to do with it. So it's great ingress time. I just get in the car, listen to the game, uh, and go play ingress. So I expect uh, <laughs> a season of ingressing and hopefully, you know, level up soon. Level up with, awesome. with that. <laughs> And what's else? Sunday. Well, we'll get to that. Sunday. Been working on the EBL stream. More about that in news. And lastly, I got to meet up with some other frogs this week um, uh, with uh, a bishop and uh, um, a butterfly. And uh, Bishop told me he had uh, some friends that actually listened to the show. So shout out to Bishop's friends. I should have got some names. I'm horrible about that. <laughs> Didn't get names. So anyway, that's about it. That was my week. All right, I'm gonna tell you about my week. You ready? Mm, Yo, okay. Whoa, whoa. Yo, <laughs> Captain. <laughs> it is Captain. Um, I got my platinum Illuminator badge. What? Hey, nice. nice. Because uh, it was kind of cool because I went out and I did a seven layer field that went from. Uh, this town called New Boston to this town called Windout, which is a few. There's like a city in between too, so it's like a, it's a pretty good chunk. But there's not a lot of people over there. Is, is that so, the one spelled <laughs> Windoty? Huh? Is that the place well, yeah, spelled kinda, Windoty? Kinda, it's Windout. Yeah, it is named after a Native American tribe. But yes, and <laughs> I thought it was a pirate. No, Arr. and um, so I did that. And then a guy blew at made checkpoint barely, barely. And and um, uh, do we give out names? Do we yeah. give out names? Yeah, yeah. We we names. Names. Local blue f dog blew it up like he was total trooper. Drove all the way out, blew the whole thing to smithereens. And yeah, and it turns oh out I can't it's believe not. You just said his name on oh, air. Are we not supposed to? <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> it's against the TOS. <laughs> is it really? He's not doing anything bad. He's playing just... the game. He's, he's doing what I would do. Um, so if I had time, um, <laughs> but I did have time that day, so I drove right back out through it again. So I got like double. You know what I mean? And yeah. and got my. Uh, and that made checkpoint too, so I was pretty excited about that. Now I'm just, now it's kind of half blown, blown up, so now I'm just blocking my own team. I think at this point, <laughs> <laughs> sporadic links going everywhere, so that's not good. But that's what's happening. Yeah. And uh, over the weekend, there was a festival at my favorite ingress park. It's a small park. There's like maybe 10, 12 portals there in like a really small area. It's just a fun little walk. And wow. then, um, but the festival going on there encouraged a lot of like it's usually always mine it's always green it's mine <laughs> and it got like just blown up every night so that was fun uh lots more activity uh i was hoping some people would i'd made some missions in that park i was kind of hoping some people would do them but i don't think anybody did because my i checked my numbers and you know how you can see how many people did a mission and they didn't go up. People, they're easy <laughs> missions. Do the mission. Look for missions. Get your badges. Right. Start putting up signs. Make, There's an ingress make, mission starting mission. right here. Yeah, like <laughs> kneel it in the ground. Missions. Super easy. Hack only. Super easy. Um, and then submit the sign as a portal. Yeah, yeah. Huh? And then uh, I did <laughs> nice. get two missions approved. Speaking of missions, one yeah. uh, in, historic, in the historic park of Romulus. 
and there is uh, like literally, I don't even think you have to get out of the car to hit all six ports because they were like bam, bam. Because <laughs> there's like the museum and like all, it's like a little historic park. So everything's like right there. And that got approved. And I have been working my tail off to get this historic flat rock mission done for a while now. And it keeps getting rejected, keeps getting rejected. Could not figure out why. And so this time I went in. To all the details, I changed the picture multiple times, took my own, you know, made sure I took my own picture, everything, made sure I wasn't using a logo, like all the things I could think of that, like why it kept getting rejected. And I had put in like historic elements at each portal, like to kind of like, like names and stuff, like just more information about like why it's a historic site oh, in right. the town. Right. And so what I did this time was I deleted all those and it got approved like that. They don't like so the I, info. I think they didn't like the extra info is the only thing I can think of. I'm not, which is a bummer because one of the reasons that I really liked missions was to learn more about local stuff, right. like yeah. to take road trips and, and learn those little local stories and stuff. So it was kind hmm. of like, oh, okay, well, yeah. at least it's approved now. Maybe I can go back in and edit it in the future because at least now it's there. But Probably, yeah. Yeah, I don't know. That's my only thing. And the last thing I did this week that was super awesome is in my little town that I live in, uh, I have one. It's like it's like me, like my husband plays, but not a lot. And it's like me and this other one blue player. Uh, I say a banshee, but it's not spelled exactly that way. And I I met him. <laughs> uh oh. Dun, dun, I was, dun, dun. Yeah, I met him and his lovely wife. I was actually had blown up his portal that like he always has and gone to uh, the local grocery store and then I was heading home and I saw in my alerts that it came up he's blowing up that portal and I was like just past it so I'm like <laughs> so I just pulled in real quick and I see him and he, he lays out his whole um, all of his resonators and everything and mods it up and I, was, I just blew it all up and I <laughs> Out and I wave. <laughs> he waved. <laughs> and he pulls around. He was wow. laughing. All smiles. Like, gave me a hug. It's the nicest guy. Like, it was really, really nice to, like, and I was like, I'm so hoping, like, you're enjoying this back and forth as much as I am. He's like, absolutely. It's all part of the game, you know? Like, so it was really nice to, like, meet somebody and have it be a positive experience because it was kind of like, oh, God, I hope it doesn't think I'm, like, awesome. stalking him, like, pulling up on him. Like, <laughs> right. And now, now, since you like him and he's nice, now you start trying to flip him to ENF. Oh, so I don't think so. I don't that's know. That's the new game, that's right? <laughs> yeah. I know I can't be flipped, so I don't think. I just kind of feel like it's probably the same mentality for them. <laughs> right? It's the, impossible. Who's, some... That would be an interesting question for the listeners. Like, have you flipped ever? Like, how many people? Hmm. And why? Like, yeah, we need some good flip yeah. stories. Yeah, I would love some flip stories. Yeah, yeah, I know. Your motivation like, and Butterfly Shadow, who um, I probably mention a lot on the show, she flipped. She was uh, res, mm -hmm. and um, and she was like, I want to say like twelve or thirteen, and flipped and lost it all. You know, and has to start all over. Uh, so I know that's been a, a, a kind of pain, but I mean, she has been just like awesome for enlightened just like making huge fields drawing huge fields uh and just a, just a um a shining star so to speak in, in the mm. community so it's like um really happy that uh the local res uh, pissed her off enough to um mm. for her to flip, you know and it's just yeah. one okay. of those things you know I, I think it's like um i think they should i don't know if make it Probably not easier is the right word, but the thing is, I think a lot of people start the game without knowing anyone, and then they get to know the people in their community, and it's like, oh, I really don't gel with the people around here. It has nothing to do with, like, yeah. it could be either side, any city, it's, it's all just dependent on who you are. And now to be like, well, I'm level, you know, whatever, if I flip, I'm going to be, you know, have to start over. I guess that's good, because it's like, and then really help you gel with it. the other side. Yeah. 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 And hopefully yeah. the new yeah. side um, will, you know, help you level up. And I would say help um, people who flip level up because they obviously have showed that they um, like your side more. And I think you can only do it or, once. So it's not like you can 
flip flop, right? Or can you? Okay, I would. I would instantly think like, dude, they're totally spying. <laughs> <laughs> they're. <laughs> they gave up everything to be a double agent, obviously, obviously. <laughs> but that's paranoid me. <laughs> well, and you know, you could just, I guess, start a new account. I guess. Yeah. If you. But well, you can keep all your badges, though, right? Yeah, you, you just don't keep, keep your, your progress. And so if you had badges that meant a lot to you, yeah, yeah. I could totally Anomaly see just badges flipping. and stuff. Yeah. Rather than starting over, flipping makes more sense. And uh, Glenn Long said, uh, I flipped to legal faction change and had to delete my account to have the current account that I have now. And I've been playing for uh, five years. So I guess that's, you know, you can flip and then delete and restart and do some stuff. But, you know, it's all, I think that's the biggest thing about the game. Like, the game's the game, but the community is ingress, you know? And, mm -hmm. and so I think that if you're not happy with the community that you're involved with, that it only makes sense to, uh, you know, flip or at least go talk to <laughs> the other faction and see if you jive with that side more because it um, otherwise, why play, you know? Mm -hmm. So you're saying I should go talk to the blue team and and uh, get them to flip? Yeah. No, and and see what's going on over there. Um, no, this is only for <laughs> resistance. No, just, this is for anyone that I don't right. know personally. How about that? Because <laughs> it right. really would be hard. Like if if uh, Soho flipped, like I. Like, what would what we would do at lunch? Do? Like, I don't know how to, like, talk to you him just, anymore. It would be really... <sighs> yeah, I can't talk you'd to you about You'd have to go to a place that didn't have portals for lunch, because otherwise you're just blowing all your weapons the whole time. <laughs> yeah. Right. It'd be really awkward, you know? It's like, well, you'd have to agree not to play. Like, okay. Yeah, um, you'd have to talk like friends. Yeah. But I couldn't even, like, tell you, hey, I'm planning to do this this weekend. Right. Yeah. Right. This no. month, like I've got this huge thing this whole month, and I can't talk to you about it. Matter mm -hmm. of fact, I've got to make up crap because you might get suspicious that I all of a sudden got quiet. <laughs> right. You don't, have, you don't have any plans this weekend. Hmm. Mm. Hmm. That's weird. <laughs> okay. Well, it's crazy stuff. Yeah. yeah. So okay. So you you met a resistance and you survived. That's awesome. So now yeah. it's um. One step closer to an anomaly where you can meet a bunch of resistance. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. They just have to schedule them correctly. They're scheduled terrible. <laughs> mm-hmm. 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 Mm -hmm. Okay. That's all I got. Is that mm -hmm. all you got? That's all I got. Okay. Well, then I guess let's do this. Or let's don't do that. <laughs> Why aren't we doing that? Arr, me hearty. I don't know what's happening. We gotta make Brent walk the plank. Ahoy! Ahoy! The sit rep. Sit rep. Yo ho ho. Sit rep. R X marks the spot. Um, the spot <laughs> is sit rep. R. <laughs> anyway, so we got uh, news for you this week. Goes a little something like this. Hit it. Uh, so we got a tweet from Niantic, just starting it right off the bat here. They said, or you remember last week, by the way, um, iOS problems with, uh, iOS 12, yeah. compatibility issues, and really then, uh, yeah. Niantic even tweeted and confirmed it and said, sorry, it's not, gonna, it's not compatible. It's just not working. There's nothing we can do. Boom. There was something they could do. So they just tweeted yesterday or was it today? I think it was yesterday. And they said, we've released an update to Ingress that includes iOS 12 compatibility. Arr! That's the good stuff right there. I like that. So rejoice. Um, there's an update to fix it. Uh, it is uh, ready to go. Uh, what, what else is in this update? Anything? Is this just so, like a hot fix? Well, I got to get on to you a little bit because it's funny. I was looking at the doc and I was like, you know, that's, there's a news story on the website. You know, the Agent mm -hmm. Academy podcast news website, all about this. Obviously. Obviously. Well, they have all the hot news. And it's explained oh, yeah. so well. So oh, it's, the, best. It it's the only source I go to. I there you that. go. It's the only source for news. Matter of fact, I'm thinking about moving all the podcast stuff from the front page and just making it news. Yes. Yeah. I think people liked it better that way. I think people are reading it more. Because now it's like, where's the news? But anyway. Yeah. No, I, I think that's smart. Yeah. It's at the very bottom of the front page. If 
you really want to know. No, but, no um, one's going to dig. So iOS 12, they, it uh, it busted up Ingress because they, they stopped the supporting for the uh, Robo VM J, uh, Java stuff. Yeah. And Never it was freezing thing. up and people couldn't play. And it was doing weird stuff. So they did the fix and it fixed that issue. So, yay. Uh, there are some small bugs that appear to be going on. So watch out if you are on the, the big screens on the, uh, I guess it's the, is it the, what's the new the, phone? 10? XL, XRS, X, XS, something. One of those X, anyway, so watch out <laughs> the big XR. screen. There's people talking about that some of the UI is actually off the screen, and so you can't do stuff with it. So I'm sure mm-hmm. they'll fix it, um, but just be aware of that. And uh, awesome that you can play now. That is better. <laughs> that is better. <laughs> that is an improvement. And also another improvement is OPR. There was an update to the OPR. I don't know if you've noticed this, but if you want Star Portal, used to it would just go, okay, do you want to skip? And then you'd say, okay, and you'd go to the next one. Or you'd cancel and put in a message and then hit one. That's a little trick if you didn't know that. So instead Mm -hmm. of doing the message now, if you hit the one, you'll get a a new, um, basically, menu of items for why you're one-starring it. I love that. That's fantastic. I would love to, like, tell someone, like, it's almost perfect, but you did this, which is an is an automatic rejection. And maybe the person didn't know when they submitted that that's a requ- you know, an automatic right. rejection. And it's, perhaps they put in like because like if someone puts in a URL, that's even if it's a like generally churches are automatically accepted, but if someone puts in a URL, it's supposed to be automatic rejection. So I would like to tell them like, dude, just take out the URL and resubmit it. You know. Well, and this one's gonna have. Um, you know, different categories. So like obstructs emergency services, portal criteria, location, photo, text, abuse, um, et cetera. And so you'll, you'll pick one of those. And, uh, we were told by, uh, Mr. Captain Andrew Krug <laughs> before the show that, uh, the eventual goal of this is to actually use that information to inform agents why their submission was rejected in the emails. So it's kind of a two part process. First, let's get in there and see if that's working. Uh, telling why the uh, one star portals are rejects and then they'll tell us what they got in the email. So let us know if you start getting emails with that information in there, letting you know why you submitted a crappy portal. We won't call you out on the show. Well, at least uh, I won't, but uh, Zelly Belly might. She likes to, I like to throw names around. <laughs> yeah. I didn't name know we were supposed to throw names around. Captain Name Dropper. It's a game of people. <laughs> it's a community. And I wasn't saying anything bad. People are just playing the game. <laughs> and soundboard's broke for some reason. I don't know why. It is. I'm sorry. It's all my fault, I'm sure. <laughs> so he I'm plundered it a little too hard. Arr, oh, oh. It, I shivered its timbers. <laughs> it's timbers. <laughs> So, uh, more news in the sit rep is uh, Are we having, this, uh, yeah. this hurricane that came through, uh, still dealing with it on the mm-hmm. East Coast, the after effects. There was actually a, a Telegram channel set up by some um, Ingress players that was, and, and it was a cross faction Ingress channel. Um, showing people where like evacuation routes were and gas stations and hospitals and, and all this information, you could go there and get help and stuff. So I thought that was really great that uh, we had ingress players trying to use the stuff they use in the game and to just what they've learned from the community to uh, help out everybody. Even, you know, what do you call them? Not muggles. They're <laughs> non nonsense. <laughs> nonsense. It is insensitives. <laughs> insensitives? insensitives oh yeah because they were sensitive yeah that's right the insensitives yes that is a non ingress npc in incense is that oh. shorter incense i'm gonna light some incense <laughs> incense desensitized <laughs> uh. no because that would be they were sensitive at one point yeah <laughs> insensitives censored no censored insensitive ah. sounds like a bunch of jerks though <laughs> <laughs> They're insensitive. Scallywags! Yeah. <laughs> Scallywags. Okay, so great job. Um, 
shout out to uh, everybody who was involved with that. It's really cool. As well as more information from the, the Kruganator who said the AMA uh, should be released. The answer is either tonight or tomorrow. And we're recording this on a Wednesday night. So expect it Thursday, uh, possibly Friday, uh, Wednesday night, next week, something. It's coming soon, though. And he uh, said that it was hard pinning down folks this week because of everything that was going on. And because it is so late, don't expect an AMA for October. But okay. there's a lot of other stuff going on in October, right? So get ready for the, the an oh, yeah. Ingress anime and uh, our, our awesome uh, Hallow Green party. Hallow Green! Ah! Yeah. Yeah. Hashtag that shit! Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. Curse nice. Me. Hello, Green. I guess we'll make up the plans um, between shows. We'll figure it out. Yeah. We let won't. everyone know, I guess, uh, ASAP so we can plan it. Yeah. Cool. Um, also, Ingress Anime posted a new tweet. Uh, something awakens in 18 o'clock tomorrow. So I don't know which Ooh. clock that is. Yeah. Is that like. Yeah, that's weird. Like that, that would be, uh, you know, 12 o'clock is 24. So, uh, what, what time would that be? Six o'clock, uh, six o'clock. But is that see. like in Japan? So what time is that in Japan? Yeah. Japan is GMT plus nine. Okay. And where am I at it, six? Or is so, it 18 o'clock GMT? Exactly. And right. then you have to configure it, you know? Oh yeah. All oh, right. Oh, there you go. See, that's another reason we should just get a, get rid of time zones all together. I agree, sir. Yes. Wow, I will yes. Exactly. Wake up at totally. 8 p.m. every day and go to work if that's what it takes. I will live in that time. <gasps> yeah. Pretty cool. <laughs> I'll do it. You know what else is cool? The EBL. This is for the enlightened folks out there, though they, they have stated in the past that they will open up their code bank for some resistance who want to. Um, create their own Bundesliga. I don't even know if I'm saying that right. We'll find out Sunday morning for the EBL World Cup. We'll be announcing and, and picking the uh, the uh, what do you call it? The re no the groupings of the the final teams with a little spinning board and uh, we'll do a little mini show on Sunday morning with the uh, two guys who run the league uh, for the EBL. Uh, so this is the EBL World, World Cup. Exciting stuff. So tune in Sunday for that if you want to watch and hear more about it. Awesome. And, EBL. Uh, I'm, and I'm we'll have, have that. Uh, I guess we'll, we'll you can catch the recording of that, too, if you're not there live. Yes. You can catch the recording <laughs> if you have a baseball mitt. Are you going to play us a, um, a little... Uh, Bumper? Maybe. What's in the capsule? <laughs> he is a trooper. <laughs> that was it. Cool. All right. That was it. Was, uh, wait, more lyrics, but hey, it's short and sweet, it's the best kind. So, uh, what is in the capsule? What a freaking good question that is. And I think, you know, I say this every week it's going to be terrible, it's going to be terrible. This week it really is going to be terrible. No, sorry. Can I go first? Because mine's the worst. Yes, okay. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yeah. And I would really like people to have something like a little better to think about after I'm done. Like, so. okay. <laughs> okay. It drives me nuts. You ever go? I mean, you've gone to a drive-in in any fast food place, and like the person in front of you doesn't pull up, and so there's this massive gap, and so you're left like yelling your order. <laughs> into the fast food because you're like you can't get all the way up because they won't pull up because it's like well it's not my turn yet because like they, they don't see any point in moving up because they're not to the window yet because mm -hmm. there's another car in front of them and there's this massive gap that was like dude i could like comfortably place my order if you just pull up and i would just like and like <laughs> like to tell people to pull up well it's like compounded a million times by playing ingress because i'm like at a stoplight and it's like Okay, I'm one car length away from being able <laughs> to have, and we're at a stoplight, and but there's this this person in front of you, uh, and they will not pull up, and there's like a car length face. wasted, wasted, and I want some sort of app 
or something that will tell these people to pull up. It's, it's a uh, it's a called a of, car horn. Some sort of community effort where we all just agree to pull up. <laughs> I like that. I like uh, yeah. reduce the reduce the space between car links b- b- between cars. It stops. That's that's what we call landlubber issues. <laughs> that's that's my thing. I want an I want a button in ingress that tells people not playing ingress in front of me to pull up. <laughs> that's what I want. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I know exactly what you mean. But I, that always happens too, and I'm just like, ah, oh. and I'm like putting my arm like at the the yes. it, like just smushing it right up against the glass, like as far as I can <laughs> forward on the dashboard. I'm like, oh, if my car was a little bit longer, and, and um, like, do your arm real fast towards that window to see if you can get yes, a little bit of movement, yes. and then hang yeah. real quick. Yes. <laughs> Hey. The, old, the old boomerang Absolutely. or whatever, yeah. Absolutely. Or just like it. run into them and just slowly push them. <laughs> it's another yeah. option. By yeah. the time I'm about to lose it, that's usually when the light turns. So, you know, they always <laughs> remain safe. <laughs> oh, and then you yell at the poor people at the counter. <sighs> the poor no, people. No, they're going to serve me coffee. So that's fine. Yeah, and you know not like spit. poor, like financially, like poor, like in it's sad that she's going to be yelling at them. <laughs> I don't yell at them; they're going to give me coffee. Oh, I've been around I, you. I get you coffee every morning, so they spit in your coffee. You yell at they them. They do not spit in my coffee. I'm nice to them. They provide the coffee. <laughs> they're it's Tim Hortons. It's a Canadian company. They don't spit in stuff. They apologize. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry that car wouldn't pull up, eh? <laughs> <laughs> oh Tim. Yeah. Who anyway. is a who? So I have an idea, and it's all because of you, Captain Zelly Belly. So I appreciate it. I apologize. Okay. No, this is great. So first they would have to fix the whole mission thing of getting the data for the text of what the mission is. But then what if it read to you? Like it could be Ada could read like it, they need to make Ada like a a voice or no a text to voice voice so then then it could just read off the information from your description as you're playing a mission almost like you know when you go to like a um a tour and they're like get the free audio version and you just yeah. listen to it and go. so it'd be kind of like that as you're doing the missions it would tell you about the stuff and then you'd go to the next portal and tell you about the next stuff yeah that's like a whole tour app built in ingress I like that because that is pretty cool. They do have like um, you could overlay certain points, like field trip points, yeah, in in there already, and that gives you more historic information. But by having it be like from that voice, that would be super cool. Yeah, um, and you wouldn't have to leave mm-hmm. the app then. And turn so. by turn directions then, like it'd be easy at that point, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. It seems mm-hmm. like that's. Compete with ways. Yeah. More money, more data. <laughs> nice. I like it. Okay. So these aren't too terrible. Um, oh, we'll, mine, we're going to make up for it in this next one, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Mine, mine, was, mine required terrible. magical elements, I'm sure. Like, <laughs> magical we like magic. Elements. Oh, yeah. So, um, Mine is a uh, kind of a well, it's really like a bug. So I just kind of figure, hey, I'll bring this up because uh, you guys aren't having this bug, but I am. I don't know why. So I'm on Android and I have a Pixel Two phone, not the XL, the small Pixel Two. And what's happening is, um, I doubt you can see this, but if you're watching the video version of this podcast, <clears throat> you'll see um, uh, there's one line always visible. Uh, from the comms on the bottom of your scanner. Uh, there's always one line that you can read down there, right? Well, the, my line down there is cut halfway. It's like just half of the words. And I can usually read it, but it's like I have to kind of concentrate a little bit, you know? I'd rather just glance down there and go, oh, someone's, okay, someone's attacking or this or I don't know, just anything. It's just more annoying, really, I guess. I don't know. I, I don't know. But you guys aren't seeing it. It's not appearing on the Android... Uh, on Brent's or on Goonie Guy's Pixel 2, 
It's the same phone I have. Uh, it's not happening on we share Jelly's a phone. X X. Uh, you have the um, X. Or, do you have the new or you have the iPhone something ten right? Who me? No. Uh, no, Zelly Belly. Uh, I don't know. I got it in January. It was new. No, I think I have the eight. I think I got the eight because the ten wasn't really worth it. You know what I mean? Okay. Um, so I don't know. It's just weird, but you know, it's like, do they spend time fixing bugs that don't really matter or do they, you know, continue cranking out the awesome, you know, next version, um, prime, right? It's like, obviously they're, they're focused heavily on prime right now, but like, so I don't know. I, I know it sucks, but it's just like, oh, well, it's there. Oh, and see, wait, are you getting... What? I'm getting live yeah. messages from people while we're recording. Isn't that awesome? By the way, <laughs> yeah, you should read them out. I got one from uh, yeah. Apostar says, "Hey, Goonie guy, got any meth in the hole this week or bathtub gin? We always got it cooking down here in the south in the bathtub." Apostar <laughs> messages me as well. When does your faction change go through? <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> we love them messages. That's awesome. So I sorry to, I was a little yeah. off when you were asking me about my phone, but I think it's an app. I have this phone. I don't know. It's this one. <laughs> it's that Dude, one right there. I got That's this one. Phone. I think it's the eight because um, when I went to the store, actually, they told me like um, it's it the upgrade, the amount of money that it costs. Like it really, unless I care about it. They're like, mm, yeah, it's not worth it. Just well, yeah, because <laughs> I guess the 10 had the face recognition, but other than that, and if I didn't care about that, like, it really didn't offer a lot of benefits to upgrading. And so that's a lot of money to spend just for that one, like, that one, I don't know, feature that I don't care the, about. the best oh, yeah. feature in the world. Like, I, I don't know, I was using a, a Note 8 for a while. Maybe it just had really crappy face recognition, but you'd be like, ah, come on, it work, and it just, like, wouldn't, and so you'd end up putting in your code and... I yeah, know, maybe I could just set my thumb on it. It's like way easier. I don't even have to yes. look at it. Yeah, like yeah. yeah, I like that version. <laughs> yeah, I like that. So that's cool. So, um, so, so by looking at your scanner, you're right next to a portal, which is cool. But you're also at home. I am. So if that ever turns blue, which I, I imagine it, it probably has, right? So you can just blow it up by not walking, like just no, I, right now. I, Mm, I could probably blow it up from here with eights, but it would waste yeah. some. I, I would just because I'm cheap in terms of about like weaponry. Uh, efficient. I would walk Words efficient. Oh, I'm efficient. Uh, but yeah, um, <laughs> Banshee, the aforementioned nemesis, will come blow it up occasionally. So, <laughs> so now, now he'll know. Now he knows where I live. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> so. Right? Oh, that's and now they know where to place the eights and then uh, pineapple the rest of them to make it hard for you to. Yeah. Oh, no. Yeah. Well, here, and then poison here's a, your dog, you know. Here's, so. a, uh, here's a cool tip uh, that uh, that someone taught me once. So, okay, so if 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 your um, couch portal is getting getting attacked, quickly flip it to blue, right? I mean, if you're green, if you're green, oh. flip it to, or if you're Blue, flip, flip the opposite green. color. Yeah. Right, just just give it to them. If, if they're if they want it, give it to them. And then flip right? it back. And then so an hour later, away. you can flip it back. Yeah. <laughs> right? I mean, what are they? Maybe they'll do? throw an eight on it for you. <laughs> right. So now you don't have to waste any anything. If it's already an eight, then give it to them. Here you go, dude. Hack away. Have fun. And then they'll drive away because you live there. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> you know. I mean, you can flip that, that back to green. So weird for them, like to like. Dude, it just flipped. I didn't do it. <laughs> right? Yeah. So might want to try that later, like if you're bored. But I know that you can't reach it in your house, but you just I, walk yeah. down the street a little bit. But still, it's kind of fun to mess with them like that and keep your portal, you know? Yeah. <laughs> so. That's All right, good well, tip. Do you you cool. hit our classwork without even having to go into that. You segment. did. Boom. Bam. Nice. <laughs> I like it. Sweet. That's good. That's good. And so thanks, we've, Alex. Uh, uh, for the super chat, so we don't have to do mm -hmm. a, uh, a bumper. He for said, that one. "Alex Higgins." He said, "Factions album in the works, January twenty fourth. Really nice. Okay, okay. Prime will be out by then. Hopefully, mm -hmm. hopefully. 
We'll have to do bets to see if it's going to be delayed. Faction's album until, like, in works Jan twenty fourth or January. You know, I don't know. Like it could, anything could be delayed. But I hope the anime doesn't get delayed. Do you think that would happen? No. Or you think that's It'll pretty solid? Yeah. That's probably already done, edited, and ready to go. I'm sure. Yeah. Well then. I guess that was that was the show. Do we have any media this week? I got something to show you. <laughs> something now you won't have to find. I don't know why that doesn't rhyme with what I was thinking. That's okay. Is this something piratey? I'm is sorry, this I'm a tired. I mean tired. I am a tired. And this is media acquired. <laughs> nice. Well done, sir. I don't, I don't yeah. know if it really was. <laughs> okay, so. Okay, week, it was better than I thought it was going to be. <laughs> well, that's not saying much, <laughs> but but I appreciate it. Thank you. <laughs> so last week we were talking about glyphs and glyph hacking and stuff like that. And so I was looking at a cool little, it's almost like a game, like, uh, but it's like a, a glyph tutorial, not tutorial, but anyway, you go to uh, gh.cre8or.jp, and uh, this is a website which uh, Dude, you can start People are hack. trying to drive. <laughs> oh, you can do it while you're driving. It's all good. <laughs> it's all good. You just, uh, just uh, don't wreck while you're doing it and blame us. But uh -huh. like, uh, you start hacking, and then it gets harder and harder, and you see how far you can get, and... Uh, so that's awesome. That's a great idea. We'll link to it in the show notes and uh, stuffing. Oh, that is pretty cool. Yeah, it's like a trainer. I like that's that. Cool. We do take I questions. Commissioner 42. We uh, speaking of while um, maybe you're posting a question. If you want to leave a question on a weekly basis and you're not in the live chat, you can always do that. Audio go to speakpipe dot com slash agent academy and you can leave a, a voicemail there you can also join our telegram channel uh hit our website for that link because it i actually is it just slash agent academy anyway someone will get you that go to the website join the tg channel which then you can get the link to the discussion channel and you can leave us questions leave voice stuff in there leave audio video uh, all that sort of thing, and uh, we poke our heads in there uh, as we can and um, see what's going down. There's a lot of cool discussions that, that happen in there, and I love watching it. Andrew's in there every once in a while, so don't, um, I don't know, he may poke his head in there. He may hide, too, if uh, if uh, uh, he's busy. Cause, he gets shy. Yeah, he's getting shy. I think he's eating, eating his, his mama's lasagna. What? She's got a really um, good recipe that we're uh, we gotta try to acquire. I thought it was a oh. uh, mom mom spaghetti <laughs> or something. Oh my Is God. that mom spaghetti? Uh, I don't know. We're getting no more inside information now. <laughs> Destroyed forever. We also <laughs> have um, what is it? It's an achievement, a badge. You get a little shiny thing on our website that's agentacademypodcast.com and we we give one every week there's also other ways to get them but uh just for listening to this episode go to the website find the badge for episode 35 it will be under the episode when we post it on friday and the code is aa bishop aa so aa b i s h o p a a you enter that in and you'll get the episode 35 badge and uh, go back and listen to the other episodes if you missed the previous badges, and you can get those, and as well as some other fabulous prizes. <laughs> also, a big thing going on right now is uh, Skyrim uh, has come out with a new plan. I don't know if you saw this. I, I put a post about it on the website, but this is like a Wi-Fi hotspot, and used to you would get this thing, and you would pay like nine bucks and get 24 hours of unlimited data. Uh, which is kind of nice. Five people can connect to it. You don't need a cell phone, anything. It's all on its own. It goes to like 130 countries. It uses 300 networks. So especially if you're trying to get to like places and your network sucks at, it's great. Well, they just added a new thing called, um, what is it? Go data. And so it's just nine bucks a gig. And so each month you get a gig of data. Um, 
to use. And that's like cheaper than my phone plan. Like I'm thinking about shutting mm -hmm. off my kids phone plans and just giving them one of these. It's like nine bucks a month. Here you go. Here's your, your just hotspot your cell phone to it and use a, a Google phone number and good to go. Yeah. Right. Uh -huh. So anyway, the reason why I'm bringing it up is they are an affiliate of the show. And right now they have a deal, um, announcing this new plan and you can basically get the hotspot for 40% off if you get a year of the service at the same time. And so it's like year service and the hotspot. I think it's like one ninety nine for that. Uh, but you can actually, you can rent the hotspots if you just want to try it out. You can um, just do the, the day things or whatever. Uh, go to the website, see more about it. There's a link there. It does help us out. Um, helps pay for the website and uh, hopefully some buttons and stuff uh, to be able to give out anomalies and things like that. Anomalies. But, yeah, and it's Sky, Skyrim. Elder, Elder Scrolls Skyrim. <laughs> 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 Boost Roda. <laughs> anyway, so uh yeah, cheapest data around. Um I think uh that's it. It's time we to walk wrap. the plank. It's time yeah. to walk that plank. It's time to sail the seas. I don't know. You got your <laughs> you got uh uh your uh what your bag not bagpipes, the other thing, the we can do a shanty. <laughs> a pirate oh, shanty. A little sea shanty. A oh man. Jig? Like to dance a jig, maybe I don't know. Um, I don't have I don't have my instruments. A shanty is an ice. My uh, accordion. Do I have the wrong thing? Yeah. No, it's just so. do, uh, do that, right? some uh, Katy Perry then. A pirate shanty. Mm -hmm. a Katy Perry. Mm -hmm. uh, shanty. I think it's a, a Katy Perry. Is the pirate terminology for that? Yeah. <laughs> oh, okay. A Katy Perry. Gotcha. <laughs> <laughs> Most people don't know that, but it's true. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. Learning, learning new uh, cultures about new cultures and everything on this show. The old Katy Perry culture. <laughs> <laughs> oh my. Okay, so thanks for watching the show. We'll be back Sunday morning early. Uh, so come uh, watch the EBL episode, and then we'll be back the following week on Wednesday as well. Uh, I thought this was going to be a short episode, but it wasn't, so uh, <laughs> thanks. Darn. Darn. Okay, that's it. Good night. <laughs> I don't want to leave. It's so sad. <laughs>